Welcome to Linux Server Tutorial. In this video, I am going to discuss about Linux file systems such as ext2, ext3 and ext4 and I will show you how to create and convert the Linux file systems. We are going to discuss about extended file systems like ext2, ext3 and ext4 in this video. Let me show you what are the file systems I am currently having in my system. To check about the file system in your machine, run the following command. Now run this command, hit enter. Here you can see, I am currently having XFS file system in my machine. Now I don't have any extended file systems in my machine. That's we are going to create in this video. Now run the following command, fdisk space hyphen l and hit enter. Here you can see I have two hard drive slash dev slash sta and slash dev slash stb. Now let's create the file system for the partitions in this hard drive. Now run the following command to create ext2 partition mkfs dot ext2 under space under this partition path slash dev slash stb1 and hit enter now the file system is created for the partition now let's create the same file system for the second partition mkfs dot ext2 space slash dev slash stb2 and hit enter now let's create ext3 file system on the third partition mkfs dot ext3 space slash dev slash stb3 and hit enter now the file system is created for the third partition now run the following command to create ext4 file system mkfs dot ext4 space slash dev slash stb5 now hit enter now the file system is created. Now let's try mounting all these four partition under slash mnt. For that, create some directories under slash mnt for the mounting point. Now type the following command to create some directories under slash mnt for the mounting point. mkdir space slash mnt slash disk1 and hit enter and disk 4 and enter now the directory is created now let's try mount the partitions so that mount point now run the following command to mount the partitions mount space slash dev slash stb1 space slash mnt slash disk1 and hit enter now the first partition is mounted now mount second partition now hit enter now mount third partition now hit enter now mount the last partition now hit enter now the partitions are mounted now type df space hyphen h and hit enter here you can see these are the mounted partitions now run this command hit enter here you can see now we have created extended partitions ext2 ext3 and ext4 next i will show you how to convert this file system now run the following command to convert the file system from ext2 to ext3 before converting unmount all partitions you mount space slash mnt slash disk1 and disk2 disk3 disk4 now the partitions are unmounted now run the following command to convert the file system from ext2 to ext3 tune to fs space hyphen j space slash dev slash stb1 and hit enter now the file system is converted 
now run the following command to convert file systems from ext2 to ext4 now run this command to convert the file system for this partition now hit enter now the file system is converted next convert this file system from ext3 to ext4 now run the following command to convert the file system from ext3 to ext4 for this partition now run this command hit enter now the file system is converted now dismount all the partitions mount space slash do slash stb1 space slash mnt slash disk1 the second partition stb2 and the third partition stb3 now fourth partition now hit enter now run this command here you can see the partitions is converted before converting it has this file system now it has file system like this after converting to check for any errors in your partition run the following command e2 fsck space hyphen pf space slash do slash stb1 and the hit enter here it shows this cannot continue why means the partition is mounted so first we need to unmount the partition so type u mount space slash mnt slash disk1 and hit enter now run the command now is checking for any errors in your partition here you can see it shows no error you can also run this command to check for detailed report now hit enter we must run this command for all the partitions we have converted early so run it for every partition before converting unmount every partition now run this command for second partition now run it for third partition and now for fourth partition now we have no error for all the partitions now the conversion is success so this is how we can able to create and convert file system in your linux machine hope this video is helpful for you thank you for watching